want to bite on that. Does that mean my bite sucks? Hey everyone, this is Abby, your hygienist here at Tooth Time. So you know the drill. First, go ahead and like and subscribe to our channel. Comment below on any content that you'd like to see and let's get started. So in this video, this is a patient who is going to get retreated for braces. Now, I know you might be thinking, why does she need braces? Her teeth look straight, what's going on? That is crazy, she doesn't need them on. But the thing is that the patient notices some minor tweaks that need to be done, some minor rotations. She had a little bit of relapse that she wants to have adjusted. So the good thing about um, us is that we offer some warranty here. So you can always check with your orthodontist that if you've had treatment with them and you have some relapse and you wanna get retreated, Go ahead and give them a call and let them know if they offer some warranty to get retreated for any relapse that you've had. So relapse is whenever your teeth have shifted in a certain direction that they weren't before. So usually that happens a lot when people want to get their teeth straightened out again. Um, that get into braces re is main, the main reason is because they've had some relapse. Now it's either because they didn't wear their retainers they didn't have what we call a bonded lower lingual three to three retainer bar and that's that metal retainer that goes on the bottom inside of your front teeth or they just didn't finish their treatment and now they want to go ahead and start their treatment again so there's um, quite a few things that contribute into relapse of teeth and why patients want to get treated again to straighten out their teeth and like I said, this patient, you can see that it's just some very minor, minor tweaks. Sometimes they see very little, small imperfections and they want to get them fixed. Majority of the time, we're able to fix those imperfections. Um, or you can either do it with clear aligners or traditional braces. You can ask your orthodontist what's the best fit for you. Or you can always request, like, this is what I want, your clear aligners, and this is what I want, traditional braces, and see if it works out for you. Um, now remember that if you do clear liners, usually the time frame in treatment is a lot less than traditional wires because when you're in traditional wires, whether it's just a small alignment that you want to do, like small shift in teeth, small relapse, you still have to go through a series of wires in order to make sure that we finish the case that you how you'd like. Now with clear aligners, it's just maybe you get one set of trays, two set of trays, and you wear it for like one or two months, and then you've already straightened out the teeth. You know, pros and cons with traditional braces and clear aligners. Clear aligners, you don't have to worry about food getting trapped on your brackets. Um, you can take off your trays right away and eat comfortably with them. <clears throat> with the traditional braces, you're going to get a lot of food trapped in your brackets, a lot of um, probably breaking of the brackets. If you eat some like Laffy Taffy hard candy, especially if you have bad habits like chewing ice or biting on ice or on pencils. And well, you know, clear liners is a shorter time frame and braces is a longer time frame. Now, sometimes you're wondering or you're questioning, are my teeth gonna hurt again? Is it gonna hurt again to get braces or clear liners? I don't believe that it will ever hurt you. Not everybody's pain tolerance is very different. Somebody has a high pain tolerance, moderate, low pain tolerance. It all really depends on you. You will honestly just feel a little bit sore, but it's really not going to be as probably uncomfortable as it was the first time because you probably don't have that much rotations anymore like you did when you first started. And you need to remember at the end of the end, at the end of the day, it is your choice if you want to get retreated for braces again or clear aligners. If you have that small shift in teeth that you just don't feel comfortable with and you want to go ahead and adjust it because the benefits of you are you feel more confident, you want to smile more, you love taking pictures, you're a model, it's you know good for you, then that's your choice. You make that choice because you want to get retreated. Um, usually a lot of these cases that we retreat is because of the patient's choice, not because we are recommending that they need to be embraced. And you know, honestly, the rule of thumb, nobody ever needs 
straight teeth. You're not gonna die of straight teeth. Um, so it's really just always a preference and more cosmetic. However, but in some instances, like if you have a major car accident, you know, um, something traumatic happens to you in your life, you know, you, you break, your jaw breaks, anything like that, and where you would probably need braces, that's the point where we'd say, okay, this patient needs braces. Now, you just come in, I don't like the way my teeth look, I don't like the way they're shifted, a tooth is coming in this way or that way, then that's where we would recommend, you know, you could get treated this way in braces or clear aligners etc so we always remember if you choose to go with clear aligners don't forget to brush your trays um, if you get if you go with traditional braces don't forget to use a water pick regardless oh it's always really good to have a water pick on your counter use your electric toothbrush you can go ahead and click on our link above and it will take you to our storefront so you can look at any of the recommended products we recommend for you during your ortho treatment um, thank you again. We will see you next time and bye If you like braces content and you want to see more make sure you like subscribe and comment down below yeah.